Yeah, this is one of about four indoor soccer arenas in the Metro. They serve youth and adult leagues. They have about 200 teams each year. For about 20 years now, the soccer culture in Kansas City has been building towards this moment. In the crowd, Raul Villegas is just another soccer fan. At Power and Light, fans could not hold back their anticipation. And for a moment, there was concern it might not happen. The FIFA World Cup is the Olympics of soccer. Kansas City will be the host for the first time ever. That we got it. This is going to be a life-changing experience for me and for all the Latino community that are here in Kansas City. Villegas is more than a fan. I've been watching the World Cup since 1986. That was my first World Cup that I remember. For him, soccer is his livelihood. 12 years ago, he opened El Patrino in KCK. I'm still trying to come down from the announcement. It was crazy, it was wild, I mean. He sells soccer jerseys from teams worldwide. Uh, this is Barcelona, Brazil. The, the number one sold jersey here in Kansas City for us, <laughs> the Mexico jersey. He says every World Cup brings a jump in sales, but he expects 2026 to be the biggest ever. <laughs> he says this will impact everyone, soccer fans or not, and he can't wait. Being at the actual game, I'm planning to go into a game no matter what. It doesn't matter. It's going to be high prices, but I don't care. I'm going to be there. In Kansas City, Kansas, Brian Johnson, KMBC 9 News.